This tutorial is going to talk about one strategy for exporting pieces of a larger data set in ArcMath. In this case, we've got all the counties in Arkansas. What we want to do is just extract out a few areas that are the focus of our study. To do that, the first thing we're going to do is go to our editor toolbar. Uh, if you don't have that toolbar handy, you want to right click in the open space, make sure editor is checked. We'll click down and say start editing here. Now, if you have multiple layers in your table of contents, it will ask you to determine which layer or feature class you want to start editing. In this case, we only have one layer, so it jumps immediately into editing this file. We'll start by clicking on the focus counties, holding shift to click multiple counties. When we have all the counties selected, we're ready to go to right click on that layer, data, and export data. You'll notice up top it says export and it says selected features. And that's responding to just the ones that we have highlighted. We want to make sure this is clicked. The next thing we want to do is figure out where we want to put this and what type of file we want to create. If you go to export, you can change this to a shape file if you just simply want to create a shape file and name it here. What you can also do is uh, make it a feature class inside of a geo database. And we'll do that here by just saying focus counties. We'll say save and OK. It'll also ask us if we want to add the exported data to the map as a layer, and we're going to say yes. We'll go up to our editor, we'll say stop editing. You'll notice that we have two, now two layers in our layer stack. The first is the counties that represent all of them in the state of Arkansas, and we also have a second layer that are focus counties that we've selected out. These focus counties can be really useful for uh, extracting uh, by mask or trimming and clipping. Uh, larger data sets just to our focus area, whether that's for representation strategies or just to have uh, smaller amounts of information to not bog down our files that we're working with.